There it is. Beautiful morning in Charleston, South Carolina. Hello and welcome to Wednesday. Um, every time we go on a trip, Mallory packs for me because I'm actually three years old. Um, and uh, when she packed for me this last trip, it turns out that we were short one pair of underwear, which isn't a problem because I don't pack my own things anyway. But it put me in a really interesting predicament this morning. And I was like, oh, I don't have any underwear. The only thing I have left are these swim trunks. So I'm wearing swim trunks today, but that's all right. I mean, that's very beachy. I got my, my sandals on, my beach trunks on. Everything's fine. Um, we have uh, a, about a two hour drive back home, probably gonna grab a bite to eat. And- uh, Trader and Joe's. Mal wants to hit up Trader Joe's since we don't have one where we live. This is kind of the, one of the closer ones. And then we will get back home and uh, I'm excited to get back to work, but also to see the kitties. But we're finally home. Huh? We haven't seen you guys in a bit. I think like 10 days. Sagan? You just wanted to know. Oh, wait. I was going to say you're wanting to know where your food is, but my dad left you more than enough food. So he's munching down. Um, we, uh, we did just get home, and we had a bunch of mail that's uh, waiting in here. I think that's all from. That's all for Stephen Mail, right? Yes. Okay. And let's actually add this to that pile. Okay, there's some more mail for Steve mail. Um, but there's some other stuff that was, you know, personal stuff that came. One of the things that came was a box from Dan, um, because Dan recently went to uh, Italy. He was on a trip to uh, Italy. You may have been following his Instagram. He actually took a little uh, Link figurine and had Link posed in pictures with, like, cool stuff from Italy, which was really interesting. Uh, he sent back the memorable moments, which is good. But he also sent some other interesting things. He sent this little Coke thermos thing. I'm not exactly sure. Inside was some uh, some candy from Italy. I've actually had a Lion Bar before, and they're really, really good. Uh, there was whatever this is. This is something edible. Not entirely sure what this is, but it's something edible. And then there's a card, which I haven't read yet, which I figured I would read on the vlog. Um, it says, Stephen Mao, Dan here. Enclosed, you'll find some things from my recent Italy trip for you guys. Stephen, I got you a cool Coca-Cola collectible I found on our 2,500 kilometer journey across Italy. I saw this and instantly thought of you. And Mao, I know you're a fan of candy from far land, so I got you some from Italy. Hopefully they haven't melted in the shipping process. I know they didn't uh, when I traveled back with them to the States. Also, they shouldn't have any peanuts, but you may have to ask Steven to try them just for safety. Love you both and hope to see you both very soon with a uh, love that spans the cosmos, Dan. Thank you, Dan. We appreciate that. Um, this is really cool. This is really... I really... I like Coke stuff, um, which is good because there's a lot of Coke stuff. I've always been a really big fan of... Um, of it. I'm also really interested to finally hook this thing up because like I don't know like how many moments or what moments and it's really fun um, to hook it up for the first time and just kind of start clicking through and see all the different memorable moments that Dan has made. And make memorable moments he did. Uh, check this out. There are a ton of, uh, of new moments in here um, from new games and stuff like that that you know I gave Dan so now there's like Chula moments, Bioshock moments, uh, moments from Extra Life uh, he also did some really interesting special stuff on some of these. So, like, if I open up this one, Steven plays. So, like, this is uh, this is one of the moments where, like, uh, we invent a Pokemon called Union. Do your best, Union. Fantastic. 
fan art. Yes, and tweet it at me. And uh, and and tweet it at either Mal or myself, or post it uh, post it on Facebook. And then Dan went ahead and like Pokemon. like redid the Pokemon thing. And it was based on actual drawings from Twitter that people made, which is super cool. Like, um, there's there's uh, quite a few here where where Dan just went above and beyond on some of these moments. It's just really fun. Um, there was uh, in total, uh, I think over 360 uh, moments that that he made, and 100% of them are submitted by users, which is really, really cool. Super excited about this, especially because um, it adds a lot more variety, being able to jump around and do a bunch of different series. So uh, I'm very, very happy, very excited that Dan was able to get all these finished up. Anyway, um, it's much later, which explains why I'm wearing uh, my contacts. I'm getting ready to go to bed. It has been a long day, but... Tomorrow will also be a long day. However, um, Mao and Lindsay are actually going out tomorrow. They're going to do some some shopping and stuff. Uh, so I may actually just give the camera to them and see if they'll film some interesting things. Just because I'm going to be here trying to get back on track since we've been gone for 10 days. Thanks for watching, and as always, let's meet back tomorrow, shall we?